Hello Audacious Church and welcome to this devotion today. Um, no matter what time of the day it is for you or where you are in the world, um, it's a big happy Christmas from me to you. My name is John Shelton. I'm one of the area pastors at Audacious Central and it's a delight to be part of the team bringing these devotions to you over this Christmas period, um, just delving into the treasure that is still there for us to find in this familiar story. And yesterday we heard from Paula Dring and she talked about how the shepherds, the people with possibly one of the most lowliest jobs on the planet, were the first people to hear the about the joyous birth of Jesus. And we heard how um, rather than run away in fear or just hide away in just confusion, they decided to take the angels at their word and they um, actually put one foot in front of the other. They had faith, if you like, that what the angels were saying was true. And you can just imagine them, can't you, running down the hill in the pitch black um, looking for um, the baby Jesus in the manger. And this is where we pick up our story for today. And I'm going to read Luke 2, chapter, sorry, chapter 2 and verse 15. And it says this. So they, so they hurried off. That's the shepherds. They hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and the baby who was lying in a manger. You can just imagine them, can't you? They've got down the hill, they're running through the streets of Bethlehem, opening doors, knocking on doors, asking people, have you seen this baby? Have you seen this couple? Have you seen this Jesus? They had to actually look and seek. And because they kept on looking, because they kept on asking, because they kept on knocking, if you like, then eventually they did indeed find the promise that the angels had talked to them about. God gave the shepherds an amazing opportunity and they seized it with both hands. They didn't just put it in the in tray and wait for a better time. They took the angels at their word. At, at their word. They acted immediately. They went down to Bethlehem. They searched and they found the promised saviour. They found the manger and all the promise that was wrapped up in it. So I suppose the message for today is the fact that Jesus has a promise for you and for me. He has a promise for all of mankind. When he died and when he rose again, he died, he lived and died to give us life in all its fullness and everything we need to enjoy and everything we need for our purpose in our life is wrapped up in the person of Jesus Christ. And all we need to do is seek him and ask him and look for him and knock for him and keep on searching for him. And just like the shepherds, we will find him and he will find us and he will give us everything we need for life and godliness. Jesus Christ is indeed, isn't he, the best present that anyone can unwrap. And if you're listening to this devotion and you don't know what I'm talking about, if you don't know what it is to have a relationship with Jesus for yourself, let me encourage you to check out audaciouschurch.com forward slash Jesus and you'll find everything you need there about the greatest news in history. If like me, you have said yes to Jesus and you are on that journey, there is still so much more to find. Just like the shepherds found everything on that evening, so we can seek and ask and knock and we can find so much more of the promise and the inheritance that Jesus Christ has secured for us through his birth, through his death and his resurrection. So as we come to the end of this devotion, let's just say a prayer together wherever you are. Lord, we thank you for the shepherds. We thank you for their obedience. We thank you for their tenacity. We thank you that they sought and they found. And we thank you so much that they were the first people to know the news. Help us to seek you this Christmas 
And we know that if we seek you, we will find you if we seek you with all our hearts. It's going to be great this Christmas. Have a fantastic season from me to you. Don't forget to join in again tomorrow for the next chapter or the next verse in the greatest story ever told. Happy Christmas to you.